Uh, welcome to this news flash from the 11th of December 2022 and I'm talking about a few topics here the chat GPT AI bot uh, Oppo Find N2 Flip Oppo and Huawei deal plus Samsung EU battery replacement Xiaomi 13 Star Wars Jedi Survivor and what's new and coming in the upcoming week first of all chat GPT a new AI a new chat bot basically it's not an artificial intelligence because there's no um, conscience there's no intelligence there's no self-awareness behind it it's just a very intelligent bot that can understand and interpret what you want you can ask him to create a new poem for you with a fish a fisherman a boat um, and uh, in summer day or something like this and it will create a new story for you so it's very intelligent in uh, interpreting what you are talking about very interesting idea I think by the way I'm recording this with a Find X3 in 21 by 9 log format in movie mode very interesting as well let's talk about Oppo because Oppo Find X2 uh, Find X3 is recording this here right now Oppo has announced or leaked a new flip phone the Find N2 flip version that is basically like this p50 pocket here with a large large display very good for selfie taking or vlogging i would say and it might be very interesting if they are pushing it glo globally and bringing it under the price range of 800 or under 1000 euros it might be very very interesting indeed i would say uh, because yeah this is a very interesting and yeah very interesting indeed kind of um device and uh, also then you find an flippable uh, foldable they're also presenting let's check is it still running i think it's still running because i was recording this now three times already and it did not record anything so anyway um this will come out definitely as well talking about oppo and huawei huawei and oppo made a new deal about 5g about wi-fi bluetooth antenna bands and media codecs audio video codecs and so on but not only this this was written was announced officially verbally but also written announcement but then verbally there was also an announcement about huawei and samsung having the same patent deal even better greater grander uh, patent deal when it comes to those kind of things so it might be very interesting for those two companies to either improve their camera setup the media codec setup or their wi-fi and antenna bands because huawei devices i have lots and lots of huawei devices here made 50 pro here in my bag I have lots and lots of Huawei devices that are uh, Huawei devices other devices lots and lots of devices but one thing that they have consistently is all the Huawei devices have consistently better Wi-Fi LTE and 5G support faster uh, download speeds and upload speeds and better connectivity so this is might be very interesting for Oppo might be very interesting for Samsung as well to acquire let's talk about the uh, new European Union uh, law or way to they want to have a law now for um, user replaceable batteries so in our smartphones we had in the past the possibility to just open up the case take out the battery swap the battery new battery in close up the case and you could just go and walk around I remember the old Blackberry Bolt 9000 for example I had multiple of those batteries and could just swap them out and the, the empty battery charge in the background indefinite battery life for those smartphones basically and yeah this should be coming back for smartphones for tablets as well but also for laptops and this is like very important for laptops i remember the old laptops you could just grab the battery out put a new battery pack in and so had even bigger battery packs if you want to your thinkpads for example now they are gluing them together for some reason and i really don't like it but the new eu law or that should become eu law should force those companies to have user replaceable batteries um, would be very interesting to see I don't think that the ingress protection the IP rating will suffer from this because I know that some of the manufacturers had user replaceable batteries and back covers and so on and still had ingress protection IP ratings and so on for water and dust resistance no issue with this I think then uh, what else Star Wars Jedi Survivor is coming in March 2023 I think a uh, very cool new game about Star Wars and Jedi and Xiaomi 13 and MIUI 14 are presented right now I see it there in the background MIUI 14 reduced in size a bit um, new icons um, new possibility to stretch out widgets in various different forms and, and, and uh, folders they have a new Huawei super device like Pendant uh, or also what was it called so this 
user interface where you can drag simply those uh, items to connect like you can drag like your headphones there to connect to your tv or drag them to connect to your uh, device uh, very easily such thing that is called magic ring by uh, at, in, in honor and i think oppo has something similar now as well going on xiaomi is presenting it with miui 14 and uh, yeah xiaomi 13 the device the successor of the 12s uh, lineup this is the 12s ultra here will gain First of all, will be very thin, iPhone-like appearance when it comes to the side, not round but flat sides, and it will have like a squared off with a bit of rounded edges a camera design with three cameras, Leica branding prominently on it, uh, flash there as well, and one inch size sensor, the same as in the 12S Ultra on the Pro model, and of course ultra wide and telephoto as well. I'm not sure if it will be the same ultra wide and telephoto as in the 12S Ultra, but probably 12 uh, and 12 pro will have this as well i'm not sure about the 12 if it also gets the one inch size sensor we will see about this anyway they have also a new bag that is uh, yeah, not this structured bag on the Travers ultra but something very very similar that's not uh, that has like uh, this kind of i'm not sure if you can see this kind of structure here as well where it's like grippy it's like a grippy kind of case uh, that reminds me a bit of vegan leather or something like this so this will be there as well for sure and my cheat sheet fell on the ground uh yeah this was xiaomi 13 it's basically right now announced there in the background there's a screen running with the announcement right now you cannot see it right now but yeah very very interesting um probably after the video we'll see all the news about xiaomi for uh, xiaomi's miui 14 and xiaomi 13 as in the uh, device itself they're talking about the cameras i think right now the leica branding and the free cameras there um talking i think about the base mo model right now uh, anyway let's talk about the future a bit uh, moondrop quarks dsp i have for testing here get it 15 euros one of the best um iems this year that came out uh, harman target if you like harman uh, it's nailing it basically beating even 150 euros and 250 euros uh, headsets for 15 euros with a USB-C connector, not the normal Quarks, Quarks DSP that have the USB kind of uh, dongle with a little chip inside that has all the tuning that is necessary to make it Harman, uh, to, to make it uh, so that Harman target is um, uh, met. And then we're talking about the LG Wing. Uh, tomorrow there will be a video out because for the longest time, one year, I didn't get an update on the LG Wing. Now it's running Android 10. Now it's running Android 12 because I got an update. I will tell you how I did it and uh, what's new in Android 12 on the LG Wing and why it's still a good device. If you have it, don't throw it away. It might be very interesting, especially also for German audience here because they did not get the Android 12 update and there's a way on how to do it. Uh, then the Nova 10 Pro is coming to me as well next week. Uh, basically, it was announced together with the uh, Honor 70 at IFA. And I was like saying, yeah, this year Honor send it to me. This is the better device. But now I want to really test it out. 60 megapixel front facing camera, not in this hole punch, but in a uh, pill cutout might be very very interesting to know uh, so this video will come out as well as well as the vivo x90 pro plus i was struggling a bit do i get it do i don't get it but after x70 the x80 pro uh, improving so much in terms of cameras and people recommending me to get it finally i thought i told myself when the x80 was coming out yeah next time when they release the x90 pro plus i will get it and so uh yeah i struggled a bit with the quality but it will have the same camera sensor the amex one inch type uh, sensor that the uh, xiaomi 12s ultra has so very interesting indeed i will definitely check it out uh, so that's it for this short little news flash the last news flash for this year i uh, hope you have a good christmas and if you don't hear about uh, each other here because like i said lots and lots of stuff coming um that's it until the next time bye